Let us take another short quiz. Which method of inventory valuation is widely accepted by the Income Tax Authority? Is it LIFO, FIFO, Adjusted Selling Price Method or Specific Identification Method? The answer is B, FIFO. LIFO is not accepted by the Indian Accounting Standards at all. So from accepted, the, the, the method of valuation most widely accepted by the income tax authorities is FIFO. What are the consequences of undervaluation of closing stock? Is that an underreporting of profit A, B, creation of hidden reserves, C, reduction of tax liability, D, all of these. The consequences of undervaluation of closing stock. If we undervalue closing stock, our profit will be underreported. If we undervalue the closing stock, there are in a way hidden reserves because the value of stock is not shown correctly. If we have reported profits less, there would be a reduction in tax liability. Therefore, the correct answer should be D, all of these. The following data has been provided by Omega Limited. We have here three items, item 1, item 2 and item 3. We have two units of item 1. We have 10 units of item 2 and we have 2 units of item 3. The cost per unit of these items is 10, 5 and 2 respectively. The realization value per unit is 11, 4 and 2. The value of inventory on items would be rupees 40, rupees 64, rupees 66 and rupees 60. I suggest you stop for a minute and try to find out the correct value of inventory. Inventory would be valued at cost or realizable value, whichever is lower. In this example, value of inventory. Cost is 10, realization is 11, therefore we would take 10 into 2, 20. In the second case, the realizable value is only 4, whereas cost per unit is 5, therefore we would take 4 and we would get 40. In the third case, both the cost and the realizable value is 2 and we would therefore take 2 into 2, 4, giving us a total of 64. Therefore, the correct answer would be 3B. Next, AS2 prescribes the use of which method of stock valuation? FIFO, LIFO, weighted average cost and D, both FIFO and weighted average cost. A. FIFO, B. LIFO, C. Weighted Average Cost and D. Both FIFO and Weighted Average Cost. AS2, Accounting Standard on Inventories, prescribes both FIFO and Weighted Average Cost. The correct answer would be D. 4 Physical inventory system is also known as perpetual inventory system, that's A, B, periodic inventory system, C, inventory record system, and none. The correct answer, physical inventory system is also known as periodic inventory system. Answer should be B. Perpetual inventory system is the opposite. 
inventory record system we have two kinds of inventory record system perpetual and periodic so the correct answer is b periodic inventory system the success of perpetual inventory system depends upon a placing order for materials on regular intervals exercising control over the issue of materials c recording the receipts and issue of materials immediately after transaction d recording the receipt of materials at fixed intervals the success of perpetual inventory system depends upon Correct answer should be C. Recording the receipts and issue of materials immediately after transaction. Correct answer should be 6C. This is because A. Placing order for materials on regular intervals is something we can do if we follow the perpetual inventory system. We can exercise control. These are both end results of using the perpetual inventory system. But a success in order for the perpetual inventory system to function efficiently, it is necessary that the receipts and issue of materials are immediately recorded, are recorded as soon as they happen. Answer is 6C. If the closing stock is increased by rupees 5,000, and gross profit rate is 10%, then gross profit will be increased by rupees 5000, gross profit will be decreased by rupees 5000, gross profit will be increased by rupees 500, and gross profit will be decreased by rupees 500. If closing stock is increased by 5000 and the GP rate is 10%, then the correct answer should be if the closing stock increases by 5000 gross profit will also increase by 5000 therefore the correct answer should be a the rate of gross profit in this case is irrelevant the rate of gross profit is related to sales if closing stock value increases gross profit value increases by the same amount 7a calculate the amount of gross profit when opening stock is 24000 closing stock is 15000 sales is 6 lakh and cost of goods sold is 4 lakh 55000 a 1 lakh 30000 b 1 lakh 45000 C one lakh fifty four thousand and D one lakh six thousand. Gross profit is nothing but sales minus cost of goods sold. Sales is six lakh, cost of goods sold is four lakh fifty five thousand. Therefore, gross profit should be one lakh forty five thousand. Correct answer should be B. Opening stock and closing stock information is redundant in this case. Correct answer is 8B, 1,45,000. If gross profit is 1 lakh and gross profit ratio is 25%, find the value of sales. A, 1 lakh b 2 lakh c 4 lakh and d 5 lakhs gross profit ratio is gross profit by sales into 100 is equal to 25 gross profit is 1 lakh therefore sales rearranging this we get sales equal to gross profit into 100 by 25.
that is equal to 1 lakh into 100 by 25 equal to 4 lakhs. 9C, 4 lakhs should be the correct answer. 9C. While finalizing current year's profit, the company realized that there was an error in the valuation of closing stock of the previous year. In the previous year, closing stock was valued more by rupees 50,000. As a result, A. Previous year's profit is overstated and current year's profit is overstated. B. Previous year's profit is understated, current year's profit is overstated. C. Previous year's profit is understated and current year's profit is understated. D. Previous year's profit is overstated and current year's profit is understated. There was an error in the valuation of closing stock of the previous year. Closing stock was valued more. Higher closing stock would result in higher profits. Therefore, previous year's profits would be overstated. We have two such instances. But previous year's closing stock becomes current year's opening stock. Higher the opening stock, lower the profits. Lower the opening stock, higher the profits. So in this case, the opening stock was overstated, was more. Therefore, current year's profit would be understated. Therefore, the correct choice should be D. 10D should be the correct answer.